Hi everyone, in this video we are going to talk about the Advanced Encryption Standard or AES. It is a symmetric encryption algorithm widely used to protect sensitive information such as financial data, password and personal images. Let's see how it works. It is a symmetric encryption means the same key is used to encrypt and decrypt the data. So if sender wants to send a secret message to recipient she uses the same key to encrypt the message that the receiver will also use the same key to decrypt it now let's see the block size and key size aes uses a block cipher which means it encrypts data in fixed size block the most common block size is 128 bit aes also support different key size such as 128, 192 and 256 bits. The larger the key size, the more secure the encryption, but also the more processing power it requires. Now let's see the modes of operation that AES operates. It operates CBC, ECB and CTR mode. These modes determine how the plain text is divided into blocks and how each block is encrypted. As I said earlier, AES support different key size 128, 192 and 256 bits. Same way for each size of key, it uses different rounds of encryption for 128 it uses 10 rounds of encryption for 192 12 rounds for 256 it uses 14 rounds of encryption now let's see why it is used widely aes was selected as the standard encryption algorithm by the us government after a long and rigorous competition that involved many different encryption algorithm. AES was chosen for its combination of security, efficiency and flexibility. Though AES is a most secure and widely used algorithm, I would recommend to memorize other algorithms, their key size, block size and where it is used before sitting for CISSP exam. Thank you for watching my video. Make sure to subscribe, like and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Bye.